This is the future. the future hi guys and welcome back to my channel and thanks to this guy we have a video as you can see all this nice water lying here I had to close the main valve well, that's right we have a crack right about there and all the water is pissing out so First step is going to be to obviously drain all the water out of the house and then I'm going to remove this pipe, there we go, and I've already loosened it because I, I was already busy with the removal and I thought of making this video and I've already loosened this, just want to loosen it here then we have to get a fitting like this. Yeah, what did I do with the screwdriver now? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh. In my pocket. Well, let me see if I can get that shit loose. And uh, I'll be back soon. This uh, bottom screw broke off when I was trying to loosen it. That one is also about to break off, so I'm just gonna take a, a chisel and a hammer, cut it off, and then we'll replace them with new ones, so I can get this pipe out. I see now that this pipe was brazed onto this fitting, so this whole fitting for me is useless. So I'm going to go to the hardware shop. This is where it's connected to. It's just for the tap. I think I'm going to loosen it here, loosen it there turn this forward and see if I can find just an adapter key to put the tap straight on. Let me go see what the professionals have to say or what they have for me to replace this with. Hi guys, so I was extremely lucky. When I was at the hardware shop, there was actually a plumber there and he quickly, quickly assisted me. We cut this pipe shorter with a pipe cutter and he gave me this fitting with a ferrule so it works the same way as this side and he even tighten the whole thing up for me. So all I have to do now when I get home is to connect the hose and the, and the tap. And Bob's your uncle. And that's it, I'm back home. This is now a nice quick repair. So this is just gonna go back there and I'm gonna tighten it down. And then I have to make two new holes or drill two new holes and fix this uh, <laughs> fitting into the wall. Uh, let's first uh, get it in its place there. So we can mark the place in and we can just uh, quickly drill two holes. Okay, seems to me we're only going to make one hole since the rest of the fitting is actually missing the brick. So we're just going to make one hole there just to secure the whole pipe. And do you guys have dogs? Look at what this bitch is doing. She is totally fucking up my entire yard digging holes. I've taken dog shit and place it inside the holes and covered it up so now she stopped digging there but she's messing up my whole garden here so if you guys have any other tips that you can give me on how to stop the dog from fucking up my yard except from killing her and getting rid of her uh, that'll be awesome I even went and uh, put some treats and pellets inside a, a bottle to see if they would play with the bottle but uh, for some reason, uh, she's not really interested in playing with the bottle. There's the culprit. And, uh, yeah, Lily. Yeah. Grass is grass, baby. Okay, I drilled the hole. And I'm just going to put the pipe back. Okay, guys. So my screw is in. The pipe is secure. I put some uh, thread tape on the tap. And let's put the tap on and secure that one. There we are. Shall we test it? Let's hope it doesn't pee out. Yeah, 
Okay, put it back. Well, I'll take this as a victory. Job well done. Thank you, Build It, for uh, assisting me in putting this pipe together. Oh, there we go. I just need a little bit more thread tape oil. Let's give it a few minutes. Maybe it will settle. And then we'll see if it's necessary to put thread tape there again. Sometimes it leaks for a little while and then it stops. But all in all, I think job well done. Groovy. Thanks guys. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, if you like this video, please consider subscribing to this channel. Give me a thumbs up because it will really help out this channel. And feel free to drop a comment. Then something new for you all. There is now a Facebook page, so feel free to follow me on my Facebook group. We will be discussing behind the scene features and videos that I have done. Also, don't forget to go to my website at www.cryptzone.co.za where you can go straight to my podcast if you want to. By clicking on the podcast icon, you'll be taken straight to the Anchor podcast page where I do my podcast. And remember, when you go to my YouTube page, there will be a place where you can subscribe to my channel. Um, and remember, if you have any comments, please feel free to drop me an email. And on my YouTube front page, there is now a PayPal donation button where you can feel free to donate to this channel to help it grow and to help to support me. Thanks for watching and until next time, cheers.